Hi, I'm Kate. I'm the executive chef at Ozo, a plant-based company here in Denver, Colorado. And today we're going to be making chicken pot pie bites with our plant-based chicken. And this is Miles. Everyone knows he's going to be my sous chef today. So let's get started. First, the gloves. Got to put gloves on. Safety first, always in the kitchen. You're doing better than I am. <laughs> We're first gonna put our puff pastry in, in the oven. So we're just gonna cook that according to the package. Nothing special there. So now we're gonna turn on a large skillet. We're gonna wanna melt some butter. Throw that in, nice. The next part, we have a half of medium chopped onion. We're just gonna throw that in there. We're gonna need to caramelize the onions a little bit just until they're translucent. So this will take about two to three minutes. Maybe you can do a fancy toss flip for us. Woo, nice. Do you wanna do the honors and make a little, little stir? Look at that technique. So then the next part, we're gonna make a roux. And a roux, we're just gonna add some flour, make it like a paste inside the pan. A little bit more until it's all the way done. We gotta mix the flour and the butter together. Yeah, do it together. <laughs> Now we add the liquids. So we have a half a cup of milk here. So he's gonna pour it slowly into the pan. And you wanna stir this until the milk is completely incorporated in the pan. So next we're gonna add a cup and a quarter of veggie stock. So we're gonna do the same thing, pour in a little, and I'll whisk. And we're just gonna keep whisking this until it becomes like velvety smooth. Oh. Not looking. That's impressive. You could be my sous chef anytime. There you go. We need to spice things up a little bit. Bring out that flavor. So we're gonna add in some Morton's vegetable seasoning blend. We also have a half a teaspoon of vegetable bouillon. And now comes the vegetables. We have a half a cup of corn and a half a cup of mixed peas and carrots. And we're just gonna nicely blend and incorporate it. So the vegetables are gonna be cooking in the pan to tenderize them. So next, we're gonna cook the Ozo True Bite plant-based chicken cutlet. So we're gonna get a large skillet, bring it on to medium-low heat. Do you wanna assist in the cooking spray? Oh, look at that. She knows exactly where it needs to go. Yeah, nice. And we're gonna place our cutlets right in the pan. So we wanna evenly spread these out in the pan so they cook evenly. And these are gonna cook for between five to eight minutes and you'll wanna flip it in occasionally and not to get that nice browning, you know, notes on the side. So what's awesome about our product is it has 20 grams per serving of protein. It has eight grams of total fat. It's unami, it's moist, it's tender. And you can, you can see it when we cut into it. It'll shred just like the true experience. We're gonna flip these. You wanna do a whole pan flip? All right, let's do this. Woo! Man down, but that is okay. So I can smell our puff pastries. I think they're ready to be taken out. So in order to fill our puff pastries, we're gonna have to take off these little hat parts. And they pop right off. Yeah, awesome. That looks great. Nice, look at the little hat. We're gonna wanna cut these into bite-sized pieces. Make sure you cut human-sized bites, not horse-sized bites, you know? It's a little bit smaller than, well, I don't know about that, but look. Look how uneven that is. How about one more, one more chop? There we go. We're just gonna put the filling back on flame just to get it a little bit warmed up, but we're gonna wanna add the chicken into the filling. And we also wanna add some freshly cracked pepper for a little bite. Oh, God bless you. All right, we're gonna stir that in. Oh, get it. <laughs> we're gonna fill each puff pastry until they're completely filled. 
All right. We do have a little bit of garnish to go on here. You can sprinkle a little bit on there. Bam, bam. Ah, <laughs> I'm throwing some at you. I think we're all done here. So this is our Ozo plant-based chicken pot pie bites. Perfect for Super Bowl Sunday, football games, little outings, picnics, tailgating, whatever you want. They're awesome bite-sized pickups. Should we try one? Cheers. Okay, going in. Mm. So good.